This is the sort of traffic I'm used to back home. Um, we are still on the island. <laughs> um, we should have left at about seven this morning, but because the winds are so high, we're stuck here. None of us are complaining. We're pretty happy to be stuck here, to be honest. So we're just chilling out. It's a bit, some, some people are just like playing pool and having longer breakfast and stuff. So we're all pretty content reading books and stuff. So yeah, we're, it's not a bad place to be stuck in. <laughs> Today's plan is that when we eventually get off the island, we're heading to our Cambodian um, homestay. So we'll be staying there for the night. Um, probably get there a little bit later now. <laughs> um, and then tomorrow we are heading to the border. So it's our last like pretty much full day in Cambodia today. So yeah, I'm gonna miss this place. I love it. And I've got a t-shirt from the resort. This resort has been absolutely amazing. I absolutely love this place. The last 24 hours have been rough. As soon as we left the island, it all kind of went downhill from there. Um, we got a boat for like two and a half hours in rough, so it wasn't as rough as it was when we were stranded on the island. It went down by then, but it was still bouncy. <laughs> Um, I took a travel sickness tablet, um, I felt really sick, so I passed out for a while, that was grim. I had a nice little flashback from Greece on the last night, if you've seen that vlog. We got a bus um, for ages, um, and for hours and hours and hours, it just never, never ended. Um, and then we ended up at the homestay around six or something. Um, so they cooked us food um, and we went back to the homestay um, and there was a cockroach in my bed. Oh, I was just having a bit of a nightmare. And then we woke up to like, at four o'clock this morning to like roosters and stuff. Proper felt like I was back in the country. And then we are back on the road today. Um, and we've, it's now like eight and we've just got another three hours to, of driving to go so rough 24 hours for this part of the trip but you know some points on tours you've, you've got to do you've got to do the traveling to get to the place that you want to go it's 
geography, places don't move. You've got to, you've got to. It's going to take as long as it's going to take. Because I've got, I've got travel sickness and I've got anxiety and I don't like sleeping in other people's houses. I don't even like sleeping in my friends' houses. Um, it's just been a bit of a rough, rough 24 hours so far. But I'm excited to get to the next place and just have a chill. Because oh my god, I think we're going out tonight as well. Oh, how am I going to do that? <laughs> When I when I work in the early years, we cross the ferry from here to other side. Yeah, the, the ferry with the bus. Yeah, take long long time, but now they are four years. They already. Crossing. 